What's up guys? My name is Micah and welcome to my channel. Today we are doing a product shoot for a charcuterie board. So I'm going to walk you through how I'm going to create the setup, <coughs> lighting, cameras, all that good stuff. I'm going to be shooting with my Sony Alpha A7 II. I picked this up for a Black Friday deal. It's a beautiful cinematic camera. Love it. Creates such quality photos and videos. So we're going to be doing some videos today. I also <coughs> am shooting this video on a Canon EOS M3. I've got a mic set up to it. I record a separate audio, which I can show you here in just a moment. And for some extra, you know, little B-roll shots and side angles, I have a Canon Rebel T7i DSLR, nice little camera. So also for shooting like TikToks and Instagram reels from this video, from this shoot, I have my phone set up on a tripod. Right here, you can see it. It's not currently recording, but it will be at some point. Now, let's talk about lighting. So in any shoot, no matter where you are, studio, you want to be able to control as much lighting as possible. So my overhead light, like my normal studio light is off, or room light is off. I have two, you can kind of see them in the camera, I have two warm tone studio lights, they're both off. I have two white studio lights on, but I will probably turn them off here in just a minute so I can set up the lighting exactly how I want it. I have some backup lights. I'm hoping to do more of a warm light setup for this shoot, but I might end up doing some more white light because I only have two warm lights and I have two white studio lights and a couple other miscellaneous lights that I can use. They're lower quality, but I can still use them for what I want. So let me go ahead and get my studio set up. I'm, I've got this charcuterie board. I just literally went to Aldi and picked up. This is kind of a fun shoot just to explore product photography. So we'll see how it goes. behind me I have the board set up this is kind of the setup that I'm looking for <clears throat> I like the dark surface I've got like a wooden like a dark wood cutting board that the charcuterie is gonna go on so now I want to get the backsplash created I just have this like piece of broken wood from Home Depot that I got for free and I'm gonna put the backsplash on so Let's do that, see how it turns out. set up the backsplash and the countertop that I just used some tile for. Now I've got this wood cutting board 
it's gonna go basically right there. To bring it all into the light. Would you stay here by my side? Okay, so now you can see we've got some warm light set up. Now, just because of where my studio is, I don't have a ton of space. So I am gonna have to only shoot from here, which means I'm gonna have to get all of my shots very carefully. So let me go ahead and get this camera a little closer so you guys can get a better idea of you know how we're gonna do things. gimbal set up and we're gonna get some cool b-roll shots. That is everything for this shoot. You got to see all the photos, the video, lighting. I ended up deciding to just stick with the warm light. Didn't really want to mess with the cool lights much. I will go ahead and finish out this video with some of the footage that I just captured as well as some of the pictures so you can see what I did. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you learned something, enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to be doing more of this stuff regularly. Thanks again, and I'll see you later. It's all right.